Alright guys, Hush Poppy and his friends were arrested in connection to a financial crime of $35 million meant for the purchase of kits and a lot of people felt that man Hush Poppy deserves this and I want to discuss uh, the sins of Hush Poppy to a lot of people. This I'll be talking about in this episode. Just before I jump right in, I want you guys to actually consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon if you are yet to subscribe to this youtube channel but if already subscribed thank you for subscribing to this amazing and exciting youtube channel and make sure you share my videos across all social media platforms so that others will get to see what we are talking about and what is trending on social media <music> Alright, it's still the case of Hush Puppy, and Hush Puppy appears to be, you know, offended a lot of people are so far, and a lot of people are not showing um, a kind of pity for Hush Puppy ever since being arrested by the FBI and the Interpol, and that is something interesting to actually note. Hush Puppy appears to be self-centered. You know, Hush Puppy never takes care of his uh, family, and then actually abandon his family according to what uh, is making a around on social media and I think it's something serious about you know Osh Poppy actually has two daughters and a son and never takes care of them and it's something serious because right now a lot of people are not showing any kind of pity for hush puppy yes somebody actually chatted me up and said man i work in a designer shop in dubai i've met hush puppy several times told him my you know my kind of challenges and those things hush puppy never cares to actually at least $50, $100, man, he never did anything about that. And then uh, I think a lot of people are still talking about Hush Puppy offending them. Even Kami Olunoyo spoke about Hush Puppy not donating when she was actually, um, you know, um, having some medical challenges and then needing some money to do some kind of, uh, you know, treatment. Hush Puppy never donated. Instead, she was humiliated by Hush Puppy and Linda KG. And that is something interesting and also uh timaya uh people like kubana chief priest and then people like fino that hush puppy called them out to say man you guys are wearing fake designers yes this guy wore fake designers uh with their own money but you were original designers with people's money. That is what a lot of people are now talking about on social media. And I think it's something serious because Hush Puppy is going to face a lot of things in recent time. Multiple charges here and there is going to face more than 20 years imprisonment. That is what I believe about the story. And I think it's something serious to actually talk about. Yes, recently he is alleged girlfriend, um, a German model who is based in Dubai was actually seen with another man few days after Hush Puppy was arrested and she actually said something that got a lot of people talking on social media. She said Hush Puppy who actually blasts people that uses their money to you know buy what they wear is now actually arrested and <laughs> it's something serious because Hush Puppy buys a lot of designers and wear a lot of um, you know designers clothes and then still money from the poor people to do that and that is a crime and that is a serious or grievous offense in Dubai because these people practice capital punishment for anybody that does that and I think Hush Puppy will be facing one unless Hush Puppy is being extradited to either US or Nigeria that is what his family is now praying for at this particular time as I think is all interesting and you all have to actually learn from Hush Puppy a lot of people have been calling out hush puppy in recent time you know that you steal money from people you lavish it on social media you talk about you know talk down on people on social media but right now you are arrested uh, because you stole those money and buy designers with them and i think that is something serious and hush puppy is going to face a lot of challenges because a lot of people are not even showing a uh, kind of pity for hush puppy at this particular time even nigeria efc said hush puppy is the most wanted hacker in nigeria 
because of what he has done in recent time. And right now, a lot of people felt that Hush Puppy deserved this that is happening to him. But what do you have to say about this? That is what I keep on asking people. Do you think Hush Puppy does not deserve a kind of forgiveness? That is what I keep on asking a lot of people. Because me, I think to an extent, Hush Puppy deserves some kind of um, you know punishment. That is what I believe. But not capital punishment in Dubai. That is what a lot of people are feeling. And the family of Hush Puppy, they are not happy about this because of the numerous news going around on social media about Hush Puppy, the stories of Hush Puppy. I think when you are in that kind of situation or when you are involved in that kind of deeds, man, Hush Puppy, next time, you should be generous to an extent. You should try and be generous to people so that they can pray for you. You know, prayer works sometimes. That is what I believe. Because they can pray for you and your sins will get uh, forgiven. And then you will start living a new life. That is what I believe about the whole thing. Guys, consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon if you are yet to subscribe to this YouTube channel. But if already subscribed, thank you for subscribing and make sure you share my videos across all social media platforms so that others will get to see what is trending. <laughs>